Oh, hello there. I didn't see you walk up. Welcome to another odd episode of The Ins and Outs. I'm your host, Erin. You might be wondering, where's Sergio? Today's episode, we're going to talk to a few students, workers, and maybe a few books about the library. We'll see how do you print, how do you check out a book, and much, much more. Let's see if you can handle my hard-hitting questions. Come on. Doug, can you tell me what you do here? Yes, uh, I am a research and instructional services librarian, which means I help students and faculty do research so that they can do the things they need to do to complete the assignments that uh, they have so they can graduate from this place. Fact or fiction, there's a librarian for each college at the university. I want to say yes. I've heard that. I've heard that from somewhere. Yes. I'm one of several librarians who are subject specialists. So, for example, my subject specialty is journalism, but we have librarians for political science, uh, biology, sociology, all the disciplines on campus we have a librarian for. And again, our jobs are to help students find information in order for them to write their papers, do their assignments, anything that's gonna help them uh, complete what they need to do to be a successful student. Where is the Rare Books collection at the library located? I have no idea. I have no idea. Oh Lord. <laughs> uh, the top floor of Willis. Honestly, I've heard a lot about it, but I don't actually know exactly where it is. I've heard it's on, like, I think it was the top floor. Is that right? You got it. Okay, Good. Cool. <laughs> okay. Did you know Willis Library was named after Bruce Willis? No. But I don't think I don't know. No, I did not, actually. Yes, I did. It's, no, it's not. <laughs> it's actually named after A.M. Willis Jr., who was a Board of Regents member. Can you tell us about your role that you do in the halls? Sure. Um, I have uh, my the favorite, my most favorite part of the job that I do is that what we call librarian on location. So I spend uh, Mondays in the GAB for two hours from 10 a.m. till noon. And then my very favorite thing is to go into some of the residence halls and make myself available to the residents. On Tuesdays, I am in the Kerr Hall lobby from 11 a.m. until 1 p.m. On Wednesdays, I go to the Clark Hall lobby from 10 a.m. until noon. And then this year, I'm going to Mean Green's Cafeteria, part of Maple Hall, on Thursdays from 11 a.m. until 1. So come have lunch with Doug in Mean Green's on Thursdays. Fact or fiction, the Dallas Buyers Club movie did research at the Rare Books Collection. Hmm. True. I'm gonna go with fact. You got it. Did you know that all the library scenes shot in Harry Potter were shot here? No. Is that a no -uh question or a <laughs> no? <laughs> wow, that's crazy. Is that true? I'm gonna go with no. That can't be true. Are you a muggle or a witch? I'm gonna have to go with a muggle. Clearly.
What would you say to incoming freshmen or other students that don't really know about the library and may be intimidated about it? Sure. Uh, the whole Ask Doug campaign or Ask a Librarian campaign began at UNT. There is a, there's a term called library anxiety, which sounds kind of funny, but actually patrons and students have an anxiety about where do I start because they don't want to look stupid or they feel like they should already know the answer and it's very similar to test anxiety or any other kind of anxiety. So my job is to um, encourage freshmen. The number one thing you can do is to ask for help. Um, and UNT is full of so many resources uh, that are available to you and the one in the library again are the people or me and my colleagues so ask for help we want you to ask for help That was a fun day learning about the library. Thanks for joining me on this informative and yet thrilling adventure. I guess it's time to let Sergio out of my trunk. Ah. What did we learn? Don't eat your food. And? Not to step over your lines? Good, okay. Okay, let me out. Let me hey! Out. Never learn your lesson. Well, that's all the time we have for today. Thanks for watching.